so I'm looking a mess. It's the morning. Today's video is a Tokyo treat taste test, but it's not just any Tokyo treat taste test. I'm gonna be taste testing tons of Japanese candies and snacks with my bang! The love of my life, Alejandro. My Cuban zaddy. He is my boyfriend. Basically my husband. I mean, at this point. Guys, let me just say, I'm so proud of him. He has lost over a hundred pounds. And you guys know how strict he is um, with him, what he eats. He like never tastes any of my food. But today he decided that he'll be off the diet for one day so that he can try all these amazing candies and snacks. Thank you so much Tokyo Tree for sponsoring another video. This video is sponsored by them. In case if you haven't heard of Tokyo Tree, Basically, it is a monthly subscription box that comes straight to your door from Japan and it's full of tons of exclusive Japanese snacks and treats and candies and deliciousness. They send you things like, you know, like sake flavored Kit Kats or high chews or like a special flavor of like Doritos. It's so much fun. And every month's box is different. It's a new theme, new snacks. It's iconic. Today, we'll be trying two different boxes. The September box and the October box. And the October box is Halloween themed, guys. We love a festive moment. It is called Hungry Hungry Halloween. <laughs> How cute. The October box is available right now, but in order to get it, you have to place your order before September ends, Japan standard time. So place that order, girl, okay? Um, and also stay tuned to see what's in it and to see how everything tastes. So yes, that's basically how it works. If you order like a box this month, you'll get the following month's box. Do you get it? And like I said before, every box has a different theme, so it's always fun, always exciting. You're always like, what is, what is coming next to my door? I'm not sure, but I am sure of one thing. Deliciousness. Fabulous. <laughs> also, prepaid plans are a bit cheaper than just buying like one box. If you prepay for like three months of Tokyo Treat, it will be a little cheaper, a little discount moment, and it's more convenient. And you might be wondering, um, this is coming all the way from Japan. What is the shipping situation? So basically, Tokyo Treat now uses DHL when they're shipping to most countries, including the US and Canada. Once it's shipped, um, it usually only takes two to five days to get to your door. And that is accurate because <laughs> like Tokyo Treat shipped me these boxes literally in like four days. Like it was so quick. Shipping is $10.95, but it is worth it for the speed guys, the speed. So go check out Tokyo Treat if you want your own Tokyo Treat box. The link will be at the top of the description guys. It's Halloween. This is going to be extra fun. So go check them out. Go buy a box. I hope you enjoy this video of me and my babe trying all these snacks. Yay! Okay, are you ready to film, baby? I'm so ready. What are your thoughts on trying all these candies? Are you excited? I am so excited. I love Japanese culture, so... He uh, does. I love it. And like the food and yes. just like... Okay, so we have the September box and the October box. This is the October. This is Halloween day! Spooky! Look at how cute. Little witches. And this okay. is what? And this is September, the time travel treat. So cute. Okay, mm. let's first do October because I'm too excited about the Halloween theme. And just from the look of it, everything looks so good. So nice. let's just unbox it. So uh, by the way, in the pamphlet, there is a um, listing of all the different snacks with uh, descriptions and everything so that you know exactly what you're eating. We love that for us. Um, do you want to unbox it or me? Okay, I can, I can do it. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Take control of the video, Zaddy. Okay, so well, let's start with this. Fish, uh... In my last taste test, That's the same I fish? had kind of... Oh, okay. I had a watermelon version. Oh. This one seems to be like grape, maybe? I didn't, got to, I didn't get to try that one, and, and he told me that it was delicious. So, I'm looking forward to this. It was magical. It was foamy, airy, everything. So, I can't wait for this one, and it's zombie theme. That's so cute. Okay. And then we have um, some kind of a little chip that says Halloween on it. Some little... It's like cheese puffs. It yes, like cheese puffs. right? It's like little cheese puffs. Oh my god, wait. I Is think that's pumpkin. pumpkin. Is it pumpkin flavor? I think it's pumpkin. Wait, let me take a little Oh my, it, it has to be, it has to. Oh my goodness, all the white girls are screaming. <laughs> <laughs> it is a Halloween corn pizza flavored snack. So it's pizza flavor, which is even better. Okay, okay, so this looks like, what? You're like, you it know- It says it right there. You know more, you know, I don't know. It's caramel corn. <laughs> But it looks like a, how do you call that? You know more about chips than me. It puff. looks like a cheese puff, yeah. Yeah, like a puff. Okay, so this is, is that for Pokemon? Yes. This looks like some kind of like a chocolatey, crunchy treat, I think. 
from no, the looks of it. Like we'll find out everything okay. as we taste okay, it. Okay, so let me get this first. Ooh, like, it's I, a drink. I saw this and like I freak out. Oh my god. So there's this like Kit Kat. <gasps> it looks like a it looks like a pie. It's apple pie flavor. I Is think it? I think that's apple pie. It looks like apple pie. I think it's apple pie flavor. It oh looks so god. good. <laughs> Okay, um, now this is a creme brulee drink whoa, by whoa. Lipton. Look it's at the color. Milk. It's, it's like a milk. milk. Yeah, it's like a creamy, creamy moment. Oh, oh my gosh. And then we have these like little stick thingies. It looks like they're coming out of a grape. <laughs> <laughs> they're just bursting out. We love that. Uh, we have this Pringles. Oh! And I think that's mm. shrimp. Wait, so you let me see. So he's gonna love it. Let that. me see. I don't think so. It is Tom Yam Kum. That's the flavor. I think it's shrimp. It, there is, Tom Yan Kung. There is a shrimp riding a motorcycle, so it has to be shrimp. There's not it's, a shrimp riding a motorcycle. Look, see, this is like a thing. With like oh, lettuce. it is riding a motorcycle. It is. There's a it shrimp is. on a motorcycle. Okay, so me next. So we have this like little like star looking like cookies. And then we have this little gummy soda looking oh, thing soda that's so sure. cute. Can you guys see it? I have to get the camera closer when we actually taste it. This is a beautiful gummy. Oh, it is a little bat. Oh, it's a little green bat. It's so cute. It's probably apple flavor. It's delicious. I love that. Now this. Oh my God, I know what this is. Okay, so there's a snack that they've sent me um, in the past boxes that is like a Stick. It's like a roll thingy. See, it's like that, but like this is like the sliced oh. up version. So it's like rings, I think. Oh, that's oh. so cute. Okay. What is this? Mm -hmm. I don't know. It looks like a sour. Oh wait, there is a sour. There is a soda candy in there. Ooh. There's it's so a filled candy. Yeah, it's it has candy. liquid inside. Love that. Guys, we have what a filled that? marshmallow. No. Maybe in the past two you tried it? Tokyo Tree videos, there were marshmallows. Is this like filled? Filled, Yes. Filled. Oh, it is. Last time it was a strawberry, and the time before that it was a banana marshmallow. I don't know what this one is. It's Halloween, but look, look it's like maybe. Oh. Maybe it's like a custard? I don't maybe, know. Maybe, maybe it's pumpkin. You're gonna love this one. Oh my god. I, I know it. They've always slayed me. This looks like some kind of like a like a soda. Or yeah. Like a fizzy moment. I don't know what these are, but we'll find out. And then what is that? Monster stamp. We'll find out. We'll see. Oh, it's like hard uh candies. It's like four hard candies, I think. Oh. And the last one, what is this? Is this I, a gum? I think it's gumballs and it's Frankenstein on yes. the front. Zadi. So cute. So that is the Halloween box, guys. So basically, we're gonna taste test all these Halloween snacks from the October box. And then once we are done with that, we're gonna unbox and taste all the September snacks. And then at the end of the video, we're gonna pick our favorite box. Okay. It's gonna be hard. Like this one has a lot of items that I already like. Everything so looks excited. delicious. Everything. This is a very full box. I feel already spooky. I feel in the spirit of Halloween. Okay, so okay, so I wanna try this creme brulee by Lipton. I want. I really wanna do that. Like first? Yes. I want okay. To do it first. Let's just see what the name is. It is a Lipton creme brulee milk tea. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Is it good? It's milky. Let me smell. It's so milky. Oh, it's, oh, it's, it's like caramel. caramel. It's like melted caramel. Yeah. Can I go first? Yes. Thank you. It is my channel. <laughs> <What are> you? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being here with me and loving me. Just drink it. And supporting me in my life. It. Okay. It is, it is not it is what I expected, it is but it's delicious. But it's not how it smells. It is like tea with a creamy caramel background flavor. But it's very refreshing. It is not heavy. It is not like a heavy cream tea. But it's delicious. Try it. It is a really soft milk. It smells more like a strong caramel. Honestly, incredible. So I like good. It. I would rate this 8 out of 10 what would you eat? Uh, maybe the same. 8 out of honestly, 10. Honestly, yeah. Okay. Okay, so we changed the chairs yeah, so you guys could see uh, So you guys can see the food up close. Okay, so I'm gonna choose. Yes. Choose. So ah! let's do something sweet, something salty. I love that. Right? Oh, you're so good at that. I know. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's do wait, wait, wait. This thing. It looks like it looks like I don't know what it, I don't know what it is, but it looks incredible. All I'm gonna say is that those snacks are always really good. What it is? You know, you know what it is? They're called Umaibo Rings Mentai, and they are sweet and slightly spicy. Ooh, okay. let's try it. Okay. Feed me. Oh. Uh, Mm. Oh, it's really good. Know. I'm just like melting your mouth. Right? Mm. 
So good. So good. Like so it looked it looked really, really spicy, but it wasn't. No, it's like the slightest bit of spice, sweet, tangy, crunchy, the perfect snack. I'd give that a 10 out of 10. It's just like, I have no bad things to say. Those are delicious. Oh, we stand. Let's do this one. The caramel corn. The car so caramel, caramel corn that does not look like caramel corn. Yeah, it's like a caramel corn puff. That's what it looks like. Not like actual, just like corn, you know? Well, of course, imagine like little corn kernels and caramel. <laughs> Is it good? Let me smell! Give it here! What is it? What is this? I'm not used to sharing my food on this channel. What is that? Oh! What is that? That's like a caramel, but not just caramel, it just smells like a. It's so Ooh, good. It smells like a like a cooked caramel. I don't know. Whoa! Wait. Oh my god. Oh my god! That's my favorite so far. Oh my god, so good. So sweet, but not too sweet. Also, so like, I've noticed, like, all this, like, little, like, puffs, they're so soft compared to the American ones. They're not as yeah. dense and greasy. They're mm -hmm. just lighter airy. and fluffier and airy, yes. Ghostly. 10 out of 10 for me. Let's do the fish. Like I said in my last video, <gasps> the green one Is this a wafer? slayed me so hard. I was like, oh. Is this like a wafer? What is this? It's like a wafer with, I think, some sort of like a light bubbly chocolate filling inside. Oh, here, here. And I think this time it is flavored grape inside. I'm gonna try it first. Okay. No, you try it first. Okay. I've tried. Okay. Well, I, I kind of tried. Oh my god, it smells so good. Ah, you're ready to smash. Okay. <laughs> Take that. I want it. I'm scared about how it's gonna taste. Here we go. That's huge. Don't take it all. <gasps> you took it all. It is like the best thing I've ever eaten. Just as good as the last one that I had. Really? I missed the last one. That was watermelon. This is great. They're both incredible. That is so good. Wow. I like, I have no... No words. No words. Yeah. Like, what is this? Well, oh wait, do. we forgot to say the names okay. of, of, of these snacks. I forgot. Hey, try to keep up. That was called a bubbly taiyaki berry zombie. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> um, and the caramel corn one was called caramel corn pumpkin pudding flavor. There you go. That's why it tasted like not just like so caramel, good. but like dessert. Mm -hmm. So pick okay. another one. Okay, I'm gonna pick one that he's gonna love so much because he just loves this type of food. So let's do the Pringles that have... Ah! <laughs> the Pringles have a, sh oh, a shrimp know. on it. <laughs> the Pringles have a chip on... a, a chip? Huh? A shrimp. A shrimp. Huh? I'm sure it's not gonna be fishy though. I'm sure oh. gonna be fishy. A whole fish jumps out of the can. <laughs> It smells so good. Oh, that smells like fish at all. Okay, so grab a few. Oh, it smells so good. Grab a few so you get the full. Okay, wait, hold on. Yeah, so these are the Halloween Pringles and Chip Star um, selection. In each box, each box gets a different one. There are three options that you might get and if you get this box. There's the Tom Yam Kung, which is this one. And then a mystery flavor and a Chip Star soy sauce flavor. Wow, okay, let me try. It has a good spice. Oh my god! It's so good. One of the best Pringles I've had in my life. It doesn't taste fishy at all, like not one hint of fish. No. It tastes like a ramen noodle. Yeah. Like a ramen noodle in Pringle form. Yeah. Really nice spiciness that is, is it doesn't like burn your mouth. It's like, it's perfect. Yes, it's like a light spicy It's not meant to burn hint. you. It's yeah. a hint of spicy. It's not meant to burn Ooh, these are amazing. 10 out of 10? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Wow, this box is like really, really high. They knew this is Halloween. We have to slay it. They did just that. Okay, so let's refresh oh ourselves. My goodness. I'm gonna pick the next one. Okay. Let's refresh ourselves with this tiny marshmallow. Okay, wait, so this is called a Halloween pudding marshmallow. And it has a Japanese pudding center. So I'm not sure what the actual flavor is, but it is flavored spooky. <laughs> flavored Halloween. So we love that. Oh! Look at the filling. It's yellow. Y'all can't see it. It's like, it's oh. like, it's like an upgraded marshmallow, right? It melts in your mouth. <laughs> this is the best marshmallow that I've had out of all the Tokyo Treat boxes. It tastes like full on vanilla pudding. 10 out of 10 for me. What do you think? Two. Yeah. Two? No, as well. Oh, <laughs> like two out of 10, I was like, 
We're about to fight on camera. Okay, so good. This is sponsored. Again. It is sponsored, but whatever. I don't it's care. It's legit delicious. It's really good. Everything. It's really good. Uh, let's do some Pokemon because you like were not introduced to that franchise when you were a kid. Okay. Let's this is called the Pokemon Halloween Choco Corn. So it's basically Pikachu-shaped chocolate corn snacks. Oh my god, look how cute. They are Pikachu-shaped. Mmm. 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 Oh! It's a better version of like chocolate cereal. It's like a sweeter version and more corny. I thought, I thought it was a cereal because of the texture, but it is not cereal. Too. It's something different. It isn't cereal, but it yeah. tastes like cereal. A sweeter, I more that it's like a fun puff. chocolate cereal puff, puff moment. Yeah. It's delicious. <laughs> I would say 8 out of 10 for me. To me, maybe 8.5 because I just like sweet things. So, so I, good I, though. I, yeah, I mean. Delicious. It's just like, you know, it's like a cereal. So we love that. Let's try this soda. Ooh, okay, wait. So this is called... You guys can see so glary. A grape soda gummy. Yeah, I love a great soda. Oh, give me. Oh, oh, give me. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay, so it has, it has two colors, so I'm gonna bite it here in the middle. Okay, right? Yeah, because I need both. It might be different flavors. We don't know. We don't know. Mmm, so good. Mmm, the more you chew. Oh my goodness. So good. One of the best grape gummies I've ever had. Um, first of all, it was not too chewy. It's like a very soft gummy. It melts in your mouth. Look, I'm learning. I'm learning like the 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 pops, <laughs> the sweets, everything is soft. Uh, like everything softer, is soft and light. Airier, lighter, no no uh, fatty, no re like fat residue. No grease, yes. no heaviness. It's just full of joy and love. It's so good. It's so good. That was one of the best gummies I've ever had. Let's do this one. So uh, they look like tiny like chocolate stars. Okay, so they should be like a different. Uh, do you see that? Here. Oh wait, this must be the Halloween mystery snack. Oh, okay. Because I was like, I can't find it. Um, so we don't know anything about it. We're just gonna eat it. Okay, so it's like little stars. And they, they the texture is great. The texture is different. I thought it would feel like a cereal. No. But it's like it's soft. like coated. It's like coated. It's coated with something. It's like a donut. Oh. Oh. Very different than what I thought. Oh wow. It's like a cereal. I like. It's like a wafer. It's a wafer texture in a no wafer form. It is an amazing wafer, but it's not like a the flat wafer. It's so good. It tastes like a wafer. Yeah. It like almost kind of melts into a chocolatey sauce in your mouth. Did you get that? It's did a, you feel that? I, I felt did, it. I did feel it. We did. I felt it indeed. Wow, 10 out of 10 for me. 10 out of 10. I love those. I there like those go. even more than the... Um, than the previous ones. Than the little other chocolate yes, ones. Than the yes, Pikachu ones. Yes, these yes. are great, but I like these even more. These are great, yeah, great. Yeah, This one. Let's do this one. Okay, wait. That's Halloween. Oh, is it? <laughs> I thought it was Sorry. Christmas. <laughs> It's a Halloween corn pizza flavor. What? No. We knew this at the beginning of the video. I was like, it's pizza flavor. Hey, look, I've been through a lot of flavors. My mind is uh, like You're a not used place. to the capacity of snacks that my brain can hold. And I've been doing And, and your stomach pizza. can hold. My stomach can't hold, girl. Oh my oh! god! <laughs> Wait, I need more. Oh my god, my phone almost fell. I just ate a pizza Zing. without calling down. Money. <laughs> Did you feel that connection that we shared when we tried that? I felt it. I felt. I felt it. the cheese. I felt the pepperoni. I felt the dough. Oh my god, these are crunchy, decadent little pizza balls. These are incredible. They have so much pizza flavor packed into a little crunchy thing, yet it's still not too salty and not That's too true. strong. Not it's a enough. light pizza flavor. Yeah. Another 10 out of 10 for me. So good. Like pizza in, in, oh in, in a puff. Let's do whatever this yeah, is. Yeah, that one, yeah. That one. Is it a stamp? Is it a candy? It's both. Yeah, it's both. Lick this Ramoon soda candy, and then you can use it as a stamp with a ghoulishly cute design. You can use it as a stamp. Oh my god. Give it. Okay, we need like a paper. Like just, just do it on my hand. Here. Oh my. Oh my gosh, he does it. Ah, so cute. Wait, wait. Let me do it. Oh my god, it's, it's mm. like it's like a candy tattoo. It's great. Ah, ah, ah. Oh my god. Careful, it's a, it's a hard candy. Careful. Okay, yeah, it's, it's a hard candy. More like you can suck on it, you can chew it, whatever you want. Mmm. 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 Mm. It's like any simple, delicious kind of orange flavored. But you can get candy. a tattoo as well. Let's do this one. What is that? 
It looks like a soda. Let me something. see here. Monster Monster Gum Energy this? Flavor. Wait, oh, Gum no. Energy Flavor. It's so cool. Wait, what? Okay, it is a pack of gum. Oh my god. It is gum. So let's try it. Oh my god. Oh! Those are so cute. They're filled with something. See? They're filled They're with They're like something. soft. They're not like. Oh my god, wait. Oh my god. Give me that one. <laughs> Is that gum? Because I want to swallow it. Don't swallow it, it's gum. What? It's like really soft. <gasps> oh my Ooh, god. It's so sour. Ooh. Oh, it's so sour. Yeah, because you ate, you ate two. Oh, it's so good. It's like the perfect amount of sour that it's still enjoyable and it's not too sour. You know what I mean? It almost feels like you're drinking a soda because it's so juicy. Yeah. Right? Listen. What is that? Wait, what about that mean? It's a little bad. Okay, it is. It's so good. Oh my god. That's apple. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, it is a ghoulish gummy, and there's a bunch of different flavors that you might get, and we got the green apple one, I think, so. Oh, wow. Oh. It's like a really soft apple flavor. Mm. It's not that strong. Yeah, so. oh, <laughs> I remember it. Mm. Yeah, the, the, most, the, as, the more you eat it. We love this. Oh my god, are you sure, Mila? Guys, the camera stopped. Going! It just know. stopped! I don't even know how he noticed. Oh my god. Okay, it paused after the green apple gummy. That was amazing. It was a little chewy, mm -hmm. but the flavor was iconic. Now, guys, we tried the Franken gummy and it didn't film it, but it's amazing. It's a 10 out of 10. And it's so good. Like it's so bright and delicious and flavorful. And the gum is so soft and like the gum ball, like you bite into it and just like Falls apart. If there's like no hardness. We're like, no. ah. uh -uh. it's so good. So you missed that. I'm so sorry, guys. But the Franken I mean, gum was we're, we're still chewing it off. <laughs> so, so look at your tongue. Scream. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So up next, we're gonna try this little. Uh, it looks like hard candy. You see? It is. Wait. When is it? It's like hard candy. It is a maple butter beer ramune candy. <laughs> Maple? There's a maple tree. That smells like a maple. <laughs> that, that smells like a pancake. Let's just get them all out and you get half and I get half. That's a lot of What? Fun. No, that's too many. I don't care. No, I need the full effect and if Here. my mouth is too full, it's gonna be too much. I'm not gonna eat that all. This is a professional channel. <laughs> oh my god. What? It, it's, it's melting. Yeah, it's really melting. You put too much in your mouth. Oh my god. You're gonna have a maple meltdown. <laughs> mm. Mm. It like tasted like a joker in my mouth. It was like a joker. I've never had anything like that in my life. It's delicious. It tastes, literally it tastes like butter and maple syrup melted together and formed into a candy. And then it just mm. melts in your mouth. Mm. It melts. It like, it literally dissolves. It becomes like a dustiness and then it like, it's like a liquid. It's so unique. It's so good. I've never had anything like that. <laughs> wow. Delicious. I'm Iconic. I think I touched it with all the dust from the can. I don't mind being covered in that maple butter. <laughs> okay. Our battery died, but we're back. Up next, this like. Um, it's a stick. Ooh. It's a sweet potato karasatsuma stick. Sticks. Multiple. It's a crunchy pretzel stick with a sweet potato flavor baked right in. Oh, I love sweet potato. I'm not a big sweet potato fan, so let's see. Oh, they look so cute, look. Oh, they're like kind of pink. Oh, they're cute. Look. So good. It's, it's, like, cute. it's like a cooked potato, potato. Let me see. You took my stick. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Huh. That's delicious. Wow, guys, ten out of ten. That's ridiculous. Oh my god, <laughs> so good. I don't like sweet potato, but it's usually because of the texture. These are so good. Like they literally taste like the best part of a sweet potato. They have the sweetness and the, and the richness. Yeah, right. And the richness, <laughs> but in a crunchy texture. So good. Now, guys, we are on our final snack from the October Halloween box. Is it Kit Kat? The apple pie Kit. Okay. I, so. <laughs> I, I am so, uh, I like, it's hard to control myself with like Kit Kats. Yes. And they have the best Kit Kats. Me too. This is called a Kit Kat apple pie. Oh, it is. Uh-huh, and it's in ghostly purple packaging. We love that. Okay, it's a little bit melted, I think, but yeah. that has never stopped me from enjoying a snack. <laughs> it smells like a delicious. It's a kind of purple, right? You're not ready. You are not ready. That is the best Kit Kat I ever had. What is this? Is this like... Oh my god! That, that flavor! Honestly, it's better that it's melted. <gasps> mm, there's more in there. That is my favorite thing that I've had today. That's the best Kit Kat I've ever had in my life. 
It's so crunchy and so creamy. Yet, the more you chew it, it gets kind of like a tart apple flavor. It's tart. It's like a little sour. And it gives it that kind of fresh apple, like a green apple flavor within a crust. Like, it literally tastes like an apple pie fully. That is 100 out of 10. Now, like this is the top. This will make me eat apple pie. It's so delicious. And he doesn't even like apple pie. No, I don't. I don't. Not that much. This is like an apple pie, but 10 times better. Like, if you love apple pie, you're going to be like... Slayed by this. Even if you don't like it, you'll still love it, just like him. So the October Halloween box is done. What was your favorite item? The Kit Kat. Look at Kit Kat. That's no I agree. Kit Kat. <laughs> so that's the Halloween box. If you want this box, make sure to order it before September ends so that you can get this box next month, guys. In October is a moment. That's my favorite Tokyo Treat box ever. Now it's time to try the September box, which was last month's box. And then we will see which one is better I'm at so the shocked. end of the video. I'm so shocked. I'm literally so shocked. September has some tough competition because really? October was so good. Okay, it is time to unbox the, the September, September box. box. You want to read it for everyone? Yes. Uh, this is the time travel treats. So done. So cute. Can you see it? Wait. There. So cute. I love it. Okay, I just have to take a look at this. What is that? It says, I think it's some kind of a chip. It says Japan potato on it. So I think these are chips, but we will find out soon. Japan fried potato. Milk coffee. <gasps> Milk coffee. He loves coffee. I don't like coffee. Uh. So that's a perfect taste test for him. Oh my gosh, what is this? It's a little... It looks like oil. <laughs> it's not oil. Okay, wait, hold on. Maybe it's too cool. We have chips. to find out what this is. Okay, it is a shaved ice jelly. You You're supposed to freeze it. By the end of the video, it might be frozen because it's so small. Yeah. So cute! I didn't know. We got some noir. Noir? Black, Black cocoa, cocoa sticks. sticks. So this is like probably really dark chocolate that like sticks. so good. I love any kind of like a filled little roll thingy. So good. I is it? I don't know, but it looks delicious. We'll find out soon. It's like these like little eggs. eggs. They're little, like little eggs. eggs like yeah. tiny eggs. Mmm, what is this? Like it a looks egg? like a big cracker. Like is a, it soft? No, it's like a crunchy cracker. Oh, oh, what is that? This looks so good. Wait, are these mochi or whatever it's called? Is it? <clears throat> Mochan Dango. It's mochi. It's a three-piece set of mochi. That I love is so mochi. good. Oh my god. Ah. Ooh. It looks like a rice crispy. It's like all stuck together. It looks cute. Okay. What is that? I don't know. There's some people on it. See, so cute. I love the packaging, but what is it? I think it's, maybe it's a, uh, oh, look. It's, it's, it's a like Japanese it's like sweet candy. selection. Oh, boba madness. So it's some kind of like a boba thing. Um, We have, oh, is this another umaibo? Umaibo seaweed salt flavor. That sounds interesting. Also, oh, this is the thing that we got, like it was Yeah, it's a honey with the roll. Okay. Yeah, seaweed flavor. I don't know if I'll like that. We'll I might see. like it. I might like we'll that see. one. We'll see. What is this? Ramoon candy. Oh, there it's you go. Ramoon. So cute. It's in like a little bottle type thing. Now this looks so interesting. Oh, that is, is a this? cola ball. It's cola. And then we have some cabbage taro. Now I may or may not have had these. I feel like I might have, but I'm not sure. Is that like fried rice? What is that? It's a saucy soba snack. Oh, it's like the crunchy noodles. I've had like something like this before. Um, in the past boxes. So it's like the noodles like on the ramen? It's like a crunchy ramen oh. noodle type thing, I think. Okay, so last thing. And the most special thing, we have an ocean salt Kit Kat. I don't ocean, know what an ocean salt. salt. So it's like it a sweet and salty Kit Kat. That's so interesting. Okay, guys, let's start tasting. Okay, pick the first snack. Okay, I'm really interested in this like tiny cola thing. It's so cute. So it's you say the whole, just just eat the whole thing. Ew. Mmm. Uh. It's literally a gummy. Gummy version of, of cola. Yeah. I love it. That's a 10 out of 10. That's just full on cola. It is what it is. Like, it is what it says. I was, I'm wondering, what if you put it like in the fridge, like in the fridge, it would be like so good, like cold. Ooh. These are the saucy soba snacks and it is noodles. Mm. They have a savory and sweet sauce flavor. Oh yes, wait, so it's like part noodles oh, and part oh, yeah. little rice type things. Look. Yeah, it's like cereal puff. It's, it's like, like rice little puffs. puffy things plus noodles. Mm. Mm. Oh. Whoa! Oh my god. The flavor at first is amazing. There's a slight fishy, fishy right? taste. Okay. Slight. So just keep that in mind. But let me just say, I'm a fish hater. I don't eat fish. You could eat it. These are still you delicious. Could eat it. Yeah, you Even could eat with it. a tiny fishy taste, they're still amazing. 
Um, and the flavor, like at the beginning, is like pow. It's like an explosion. It's like, oh, ooh. Eight out of ten for me. Eight out of ten too. Yeah. Because of the little fishiness, but okay. So that is. It's a pon cum bar. A pon rice bar. Oh my god. <laughs> Interesting. It's like a cigar. Hmm. You see? I'm not sure about that. It's I'm like, not sure. I'd it's like sweet, but. Oh wait, it's like soy sauce. It is. Yeah, it's it like is. a sweet soy sauce. Yeah. It's a big bite. That's so good. Mmm. That's so good. I expected something not good. Me too. From the smell. Uh huh. Mmm. Oh. It is better than it smells. That's great. Um, it. Kind of tastes like kettle corn. If you've had kettle corn, it's like a sweet and salty corn. I, 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 I don't think I have. It tastes like that in the form of a rice crispy. It's delicious. I'd give it a nine out of ten. Very good. I would say the same. Uh, it definitely uh, the taste fools you, but this like the the smell fools you, but the taste is so good. So good. Oh my god. Okay. Next up, let's do this weirdly looking eggs. <laughs> I'm so excited. I hope they're spicy. It's literal like. Eggs, I cannot wait. It's sparrow egg peanuts. Um, they're sweet and spicy, and they have like a soy sauce flavored coating. Oh, 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 oh. okay. The dogs are gonna eat it. So here it is. It's like, oh my god, little eggs. Oh my god, it's, it's like, it feels like it's marble. Mmm. Wow. Wait, but. Mmm. Uh -huh. There's a peanut inside. Yeah, there's a peanut and it's like coated. So good. It's like a salty peanut and the coating is so crunchy. And it's like a lot. It's almost like caramelized. It's so good. That's a 10 out of 10. I love peanut snacks. That's really and that just served me everything I needed. And also just like the shape. They look like little eggs, which is so cute. Uh -huh. Okay, so this is the Umaibo seaweed salt flavor. That looks so good. <gasps> looks so good. Show them. That looks so good. It looks amazing. like little chives, but it's seaweed. So cute. Mmm. That's good. Well, my food's always good. That's good. Always. Very good. Uh -huh. mm. Salty and nice. Mm. Yeah, it's salty, light flavor, but still at the beginning it's strong. Mm -hmm. I like how oily it is. It's, it's like... just so good and light and just, I don't know. Airy. It's simple and delicious. It's simple, That's a yeah, 10 out of 10 just because yeah. it's so simple and so good. Let's do the mochi. Ah! Oh my gosh, all okay, three so, flavors. Wait, yeah. hold on. It's a three-piece set and it doesn't say the flavors, but I'm excited. I'm excited. Okay, so what do you want to do? The pink one first. <gasps> so soft and squinchy. Okay, oh go ahead. Mmm. Mmm. Oh wow. Oh, the more you chew, the better. Yeah. I mean, it is made. It is made using rice. It doesn't taste like rice, but no, it doesn't. But it has like that, you know, like the essence of rice. So the texture, you have is to, everything. You have to chew it through the end. It's so soft. The flavor is very light. It's a very light kind of berryish, almost floral flavor. That's delicious, but it's very light. Most of the satisfaction is from the texture, mm -hmm. you know, and it's incredible. That's a ten out of ten. Can we? Period. Can we the next one? Yeah. That one was the white color one. Mm, this one's different. That one's different. Mmm. The texture, once again. This one's like a simple vanilla-ish. That is the flavor of mochi, I think. They're all amazing. The green one. Wait. That one has a hint of apple. I hate it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It does, it does. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that one's my favorite. Oh. Mm, because it has oh my God. good flavor. Perfect texture. 10 out of 10. I love this pack. Mochi is so delicious and so simple. It's very simple flavors, but that's what makes it so special. Uh -huh. mm. Amazing. I like that one better than the pink, yes. Okay, next up, I want to try the chips. I really want to. I'm craving a chip. Okay, that's the yeah. uh, proud chips. These are the Japan Pride Potato. Oh, pride. A savory eel. Ooh, Salty God. roasted seaweed and sweet soy sauce flavor. It smells like a ramen. So there's a little bit of an eel flavor in there. I'm kind of scared. Y'all oh, know no. it's seafood and meat. We don't mix. Let's see. It smells great. It doesn't smell fishy at all. It smells like a good potato chip. And it's no, and it, and it looks like an actual like <gasps> like These are a beautiful. Potato. Yeah. They're like not too thin, not too thick. Oh! I don't taste eel. I really don't taste eel. It's perfect. Oh my god. I mean, if this is eel, I want to eat it one right now. It tastes like soy sauce flavored salty chips. Delicious, delicious, so delicious. Okay. Wow. So we did this. Let's do 
I want to try this. It's like a hard cracker. It's like a big cracker, yeah. There's like a little package, baby. They're called the Nostalgic Sauce Senbai. It says, make your own saucy senbai treat. On top of this milky um, senbai, add the special sauce and enjoy the crunchy treat. Wow, there's a lot of them in there. Yeah, so um, there is this package. Is it liquid? It's, yeah, it's full mm. of liquid. We have some sauce on. Let's okay. see. I have never had anything like here. this, so I'm very interested. Let here, let's this. do it here. It's gonna make a little hole. Oh. Okay, just a tiny bit because we don't know the consistency. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. okay, okay, okay. That one's for you. Spread it around. <laughs> I don't know. I'm kind of scared of this one. Let's see. Oh. Smell it. Ooh. It's powerful. Let's try it. Oh wait. That's so good. <gasps> wait. Eat it all. Oh my god. How they do that? That's one of my favorite things I had today. Um. So, oh, the fact that the the crack, like the crackers are so thin, so thin, so and thin, so and then airy. and then the sauce is like so thick like, and strong. And yes, it's strong. It just okay. complements the cracker perfectly, like so perfectly. So up next, we're gonna try the noir black cocoa sticks. They are noir brown sugar syrup and kinako cocoa sticks. Wow. So they're brown sugar flavored. So they come inside two packages. Ooh, we got one. Automatically like sweet smell. Ooh. It's supposed to be like- It smells kind of like coffee. Coffee. It smells like a coffee shop. Yeah, well- And chocolate. It says black cocoa. Let me see. So I think it's like really like dark chocolate. Oh my God. It doesn't taste like coffee. Mmm. It's delicious. That is so good. It looks intimidating. It's just like black cocoa. You probably it's like sour. It's so sweet. It smells like a coffee candy, like a coffee shop. But it tastes, it, it's like a sweet chocolate. Yes, it's like a brown, it's like a cooked brown sugar mixed with chocolate mm -hmm. flavor. Yep. And it's delicious. I'd give it a 9 out of 10. I'll give it a 10 out of 10 because it smells like, it smells kind of like coffee. So, so, so good. Talking about coffee. I think we should do this. You're gonna try that. Okay. I will take a sip, but I'm probably not gonna like it because I don't like coffee. So it's called the UCC Evangelion Milk Coffee. Oh, oh, that is, that is, I just finished making coffee in my pot. <laughs> in my coffee pot. Oh, that's strong. That is strong. I'm probably not gonna try it. Try it. I'll try a little bit, but I'm not, I'm not gonna like it. I don't like coffee. Literally milk and coffee. That's you love literally coffee. What it is. That's literally what it is. Milk and coffee. Milk and coffee. Yeah, see, I, just, I just don't like Milk. coffee. Well, I'm Cuban, so I like a really strong coffee. This is strong. I would add like a little bit of sugar <laughs> because I like really sweet things, but I think it's perfect. So what would you give it? I would like, I would give it a nine out of 10. Okay. We love that. So it's good coffee for you coffee drinkers. Let's do some animal crackers. Okay. Well, it's like, favorite. it's a Pokemon cracker. <laughs> so these are called Pokemon Auto-to crackers. Oh my so god, that's so cute. Oh, Look, these are adorable. It's like a tiny carrot. You guys, you just probably not gonna, gonna be tiny. able to see. It's like a tiny carrot. Literally, I don't know what that is, but it's so cute. Grab a few. Mm. Oh, they're salty. I love those. Mm. Oh, I love. 10 out of 10. I just ate a whale. <coughs> hollow inside. They're hollow, so it's like a puff. The flavor is salty. Kind of like garden veggie mm. flavor, if you know what I mean. That's so good. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. We only have like four snacks left, guys. Yes. Oh my god. So these are the Ramoon candies. They're fizzy and crunchy. And they're based on Japanese sodas. Ooh. I love that. That is so cute. Oh, it's like the maple things. Yeah. But it's a soda flavor. Mmm. Whoa. That looks different. Oh. Mmm. Wait, wait for it. You get it now? Mm. Oh, they're gone. Wow, they disappear. They literally disappear. Wow. Okay, at first I was like, what is that flavor? Yeah. But then the more that they like dissolve, yeah. it got this like lemon lime soda flavor. Definitely, I did not get lemon lime. What'd you get? I just got a, a delicious candy. I loved it. I would say eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. Ooh, I think yeah. I've had those. I think I've had these cabbage taros. Smells like. Let me smell it. Smells like ketchup. Oh, I've had these. Oh. Really? One of my favorites. Oh, the battery's dying again. Mmm. I've seen this battery. One second. Wow. 10 out of 10, guys. 10 out of 10. I've had those before. They're incredible. How would you describe the flavor? 
the flavor, it's like nothing I've ever tasted before, honestly. It's like a ketchupy, salty. It smells like ketchup, like spicy, a little it spicy. It smells like ketchup, but like I just love. Another one. I just love like when you have like those like green things on it. I love that. Mmm. So good. So good. Okay. Okay. We only have two left. Only the Kit Kat and this. Two kinds of candies, basically. Tyrol Choco. Japanese sweet selection. Okay, so this is the pink one. Let's see. Mmm, it's filled with something. Oh, it's gooey inside. I don't know if you have something like this. Mm. The milkiness is oh. unreal. One of the one of my favorite things today. It's like it's like a gummy meets like a gelatin type thing. Yes. Right. It's like a mochi gummy type of thing. Mm-hmm. And it has like a citrusy flavor inside. Yeah. Oh wow! Look, that one is okay. chocolate at the bottom. <laughs> This is just like tea. Hmm. A little bit. Oh, I like it's just that. like tea, like a milky tea. I like it. I like the pink ones more, but overall, 8 out of 10. Delicious. Okay, last but not least! Ah! The more Kit Kat. So this one is Ocean Salt. You need to read the, the pamphlet to see what it is. Kit Kat are I'm finding ways uh, to improve the future through snacks. Japanese sea salt is worked into the cream, then sandwiched between wafers and wrapped in white chocolate. And for every bag sold, Kit Kat will donate 10 yen uh, to um, zero waste uh, Japan's activities. That's amazing! We love charity! And yes, I eat both at the same time, guys. Uh-huh. Oh my god. Wow. I'm having a moment. Oh, it's salty. That is white chocolate saltiness perfection. That is the second best Kit Kat I've ever had. Do you agree? Second best because the apple pie was a little yeah, bit better. Yeah, that October like destroyed. But these are incredible. Second best is still real, real high up there. Yeah. So balanced, so good, 100% amazing. 10 out of 10. So good. Well, guys, that was the whole taste test. We tried both September and October boxes. Which was your favorite? You tell me first. I think October destroyed me. October was the best box in my humble opinion. All the festive candies, everything tasted delicious. Like, Ooh. it's so much fun, so good. Once again, if you want the October box, make sure to order it now before September ends. Japan Standard Time. Once again, this video was sponsored by Tokyo Treat. Thank you so much, Tokyo Thank Treat. You. Every video is like a little party and I love it so much. Go check out Tokyo Treat. The link will be at the top of the description. Go check them out right now if you want your own box. And yeah, what do you think overall? How was the experience, Bubsy? Hmm. I'll take that as, oh damn, it was a good time. <laughs> it was so much fun. So much fun! It was so much fun. Thank you so much, Tokyo Tree. Thank you, Tokyo Tree. I love you guys so much. I'll see you next video. Oh, oh. oh. I did. <laughs> guys, we forgot. We're here again. <laughs> oh my gosh, and it's kind of frozen. We forgot the little frozen popsicle thingy. It's real full. Okay. Ooh, ooh, yeah, it's froze. <gasps> Wait, what? Wait. Wait, what? It's like a jelly. Wait, what is that? It's like a... <laughs> I was like, yeah. oh, whoa. It's like a jelly. Whoa, I was like, how is that ice not breaking? I'm so confused, that's so good. It's like a lemon jelly. I love it. Guys! Bye. 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 Bye.